Welcome to Moo Moo Math and Science. In this video, let's go over how to factor a trinomial in which the leading coefficient is not equal to 1. And if you'll notice, we have 10x squared plus 19x plus 6. So 10 is not 1. The first step I think will help is to draw an x. And at the top of the x, you will place a times c, and at the bottom, you will place b. Okay? So 10 times 6 is 60, and then the middle term is 19. Now what you need to do is find two numbers that add together, excuse me, multiply together to equal the 60, multiply together, and then add to equal the bottom of the x. So if I factor uh, 60, I have 1 times 60, 2 times 30, 4 times 15. And if you add 15 and 4, you indeed get 19. So I have these two terms. Now, I'm going to take the middle term and basically split it in half. So, and then rewrite the trinomial. So, I'm going to bring down the 10x squared. And then I'm going to go ahead and write the 15 and add an x. So, I have 10x squared plus 15. Then I'm going to take the Four, and it becomes 4x and bring down the 6. Now I have two terms, 10x squared plus 15x plus 4x plus 6. Now I'm going to factor out the greatest common factor for both of these. With 10x squared plus 15x, I can factor out the greatest common factor of uh, 5x. So I have 5x times 2x plus Three, because 5 goes into, excuse me, 5x goes into 10x squared 2x times, and then it goes into 15 three times. And then the greatest common factor for 4x plus 6 is 2. So then when I factor it out, I go 2 times 2x plus 3. Now, if you'll notice, whatever is in the parentheses, it should match. So I have 2x plus 3 and 2x plus 3. So now all I do is write out the factors. So I'm going to do this, but I'm going to take the two numbers right in front, in front of the parentheses. So it's going to be 5x plus 2 and then 2x plus 3. I hope this was helpful. Thanks for watching. And remember, kindness multiplies kindness. Be kind to someone today.